I'm Margaret McCabe Janicki. My second story is um, from when I was little. So from the time I was about mm, maybe seven-ish, seven, eight, up until my late teens, I um, would periodically, you know, I was living at home. I was living with my parents at the time. Um, and I would wake up at, at night. I'd be sleeping in my bed. Next thing you know, I'd wake up like out in the hallway or somewhere else outside my bedroom. And I'd have to walk back to bed past a figure that was standing there and it was pitch dark in the room. I could not see this person physically, but I could see them in my mind's eye. And I knew what they looked like. It was an older man with a tweed cap. And, um, you know, I would have to walk past this person to get back into bed. And I would always turn the light on and there wouldn't be anyone there. And um, a few years later, at some point, I saw a picture of my grandfather, who um, I had never known because uh, myself and my sibling were the youngest of the grandkids. And my grandfather had died before we were born. We were the only two that he hadn't met. And, you know, I'm the first to say, well, I probably saw that picture and I maybe put that together in my mind with this presence that I was passing by. I can't prove any of it, but I do believe that there's a realm beyond our own. And um, so I do believe that was my grandfather, you know, just kind of check it in to see the grandkids, grandkid that he'd never met.